My name is Marlene Martin, and I'm a clinician educator at UCSF. I work at Zuckerberg San Francisco General. The addiction care team's mission is to provide high quality, evidence-based, compassionate care to people who use drugs, and we focus on harm reduction, medication treatment, and linkage to care. The pride values are exemplified through this team via seeing that there was a gap in care for people who were hospitalized with substance use disorders and that we were not providing them the high quality care that we could for their substance use disorder. We're taking care of everything else, but here is this patient who's coming back with complications um, from their injection drug use, for example. So they're coming in with a skin infection. We're so good at taking care of the skin infection, but we weren't really great at addressing the, the root cause of, of their illness, and that's their, their substance use disorder. I'm surrounded by people who I know want to be here, who are dedicated to improving care for vulnerable patient populations. And that is really what has brought, what brought me back to, to UCSF after um, leaving for a couple of years for residency. And part of the reason that I came back, in addition to wanting to be at this uh, mission-driven safety net hospital that is a part of UCSF and part of the San Francisco Department of Public Health was that I there were so many people when I was at UCSF who really cared about me and wanted to hear about my career and wanted to know what I wanted to do and how they could help me and that continued to do that even when I was at another institution. I'm here doing the work I'm doing because of my parents' focus on social justice. I'm a first-generation bilingual and bicultural Mexican-American physician, and my parents were really instrumental in showing me how to give, me and my siblings, how to give back for the opportunities that I was given. So the Watson Scholar is going to allow me to gain formal implementation science training so that I can grow and evaluate the addiction care team to better serve the needs of hospitalized patients with substance use disorders. It's also going to allow me to eventually focus on the subset of patients that I'm really interested in, and that's um, um, Spanish-speaking patients with severe alcohol use disorder. I, over time, would like to um, would like to form a partnership with one of our community-based organizations to learn from the patients and from the organization what people's needs are in the community and how we can um, how can we um, better how we can serve these patients when they're not in the hospital and so taking sort of taking a step back from just hospitalized patients to um, focus on people who are having risky use who and focus on on sort of um, rewinding things a little bit. I feel really lucky to be in such amazing company. The fact that this this um, even exists is huge. I think it means that UCSF is committed to recruiting, retaining, and diversifying the faculty. And um, I am just, I feel really lucky to be part of, of of this wonderful group of people, this community. There's a couple of years now of people who have received this award before me and who will continue to receive this award. And I think thinking of how we can support each other and um, also how we can uh, mentor others and, and the sponsorship that you receive through the program, I feel, feel really lucky. To me, it means that UCSF is investing in me, that they want me to stay, and that they want my, to see my career develop. And so I think that is just, it's, it's really special.